I'm Karen Morley, your City Sleuth, and today we're here with Bianca at the RCMP Heritage Center. Bianca, can you tell us about what we see here? Well, right now we're walking through the galleries. We have six uh, long-term galleries that tell the story of the RCMP, which is a really great story. It's one of the oldest stories we have in Canada, and uh, I personally think, although I might be a little biased, <laughs> one of the best. <laughs> Uh, it starts in 1873 and it tells the story of the Northwest Mounted Police and it takes you right up until present day with our exhibit on cracking the case. Now this stuff is amazing to me. Now I know you mm -hmm. said that it's here all the time, but you also said you have some programs and docents. Can you tell us a little more about that? Well yes, we have so many stories within the story. So um, through our programming and special events, we're able to sort of focus on maybe one artifact or one period in time and then evolve that story so that people learn a little bit more about it. We only have a fraction of the artifacts that the RCMP own out here on display right now. Okay, and and the docents that you have, you said, can tell you personal stories about some of these. Exactly, most of our docents are retired RCMP members, and so they've been out there, they've, they've put in, you know, 30, 35 years in the force, and they can, they can really elaborate. That's amazing, mm -hmm. I just find all this stuff fascinating. The other thing that I saw that you showed me is an interactive thing, so if you're bringing the kids along, mm -hmm. tell us about that. Well, that's just in here. It's called Cracking the Case, and it's our sort of it's like a CSI exhibit. It has a lot of tactile functions, so children love it. So the kids can be a detective here. Yes, it's all interactive. So this is the scene of the crime, and they can touch different things and see maybe what kind of gun there was, what the injury is, maybe what this money is doing here. Okay, so kids are into the whole hack doll thing. They quite like it and they can look at shell casings and this is one of the more popular pieces wow. of this exhibit. They can actually take a look at their own fingerprint. So you put your finger on there and you get a fingerprint. Wow, yeah. that's awesome. And it looks like you have a radial loop. Uh-oh. That could be <laughs> trouble for me. But you also, this is all modern day officer stuff. So we've yes. seen the antique stuff and you also have modern day mm -hmm. stuff. Let's talk some more about that. So, well, Bianca, this obviously isn't the Four Seasons. What can you tell me about this? Uh, this is one of our new exhibit pieces. It just went up a couple months ago and it is an actual dormitory or the inside of a dormitory that you'd find over at Depot. They're doing a lot of refurbishing right now. So we were lucky enough to get uh, sort of a piece of one of their most recent dormitories. Do they have a bounce a quarter off the <laughs> sheets? Pretty much. Uh, the sergeant comes through and does a drill, uh, does an inspection, and if it's not up to par, and if they haven't ironed everything properly, he flips the bed. So these things get thrown out. And so, is this part of the things that you, we talked about some day camps? Is this part of the things that the kids could see during day camps? Yep. Uh, we've also had um, cadets come down and um, you know do sort of a run through of that in the past. So people have actually been able to see what it would be like in a dormitory with your bed being flipped, with you being yelled <laughs> at for not doing things properly. That'll teach par. the kids to make their beds, won't it? Exactly. I actually hear some kids. So this looks like a young troop of kids. Yes, this would be uh, our six to eight age group. And they're doing a little day camp because it's reading week. And we're trying out some of our mini marching mountie and mini musical ride camp maneuvers on them today. This looks like a lot of fun. If I was their age, I would love to come down here and do this. So they're having a good time. They're having a good time. So we're here at the RCMP Heritage Center. Come on down. Bring the kids for day camp. Meet Sergeant Bull Moose. I'm Karen Morley, your city sleuth. Thanks for joining us.